Today's video is about our trip to Claymount Landscape Garden just out of London in Isha. We spent a few hours there just walk around the grounds and play a little bit Pokemon. Hopefully you will enjoy this day trip video. Where we sat is actually a pokey stop, so I'm going to spin that pokey stop. It's, and there's quite a few spoons here. The signal, mobile signal, isn't particularly good here so far, though. There's a Wi Fi in the cafe. If I look at it, there are two gyms, eight, eight pokey stop. So that's pretty awesome, I think. We'll have a bit exploring after the breakfast and see how everything goes. in Claremont landscape garden today and it's kind of a routine now we kind of come into the cafe have something to eat before we go exploring today I'm being like really really adventurous right Bichu strong cream tea with a cloud tick cream and strawberry jam let's just try this right why not I've never had it before it actually looks very very pretty You can see the beetroot inside though You can see it's there I'm going to try and see how that goes Because the last time I had the cheese scone with the clotted cream and jam Strawberry, no raspberry jam It's actually quite nice Happy that savory taste and the sweet taste are together Yeah, it's different Ready. Let's try this. So, beetroot scone with a cloudy cream and strawberry jam. Okay. It's definitely interesting. The beetroot is still quite crunchy though. You can still can definitely can taste that sort of a earthy sort of taste. It's okay. Would I have it again? Let me try. Hold on. Mm. Yeah, it's alright. It's okay. <laughs> it's very, very cute though, this tea room. The cafe itself is super nice uh, inside, very cozy. It has that like, really, really nice patio cafe area and plants that they are selling here that are on the table as decoration. It doesn't feel super busy at the moment, but I don't know if it's because the weather forecast is not going to be a very nice day. I can see the cloud is already coming in, it's getting a bit colder now as well. But hopefully though, we're not going to get rain on today. Okay, apparently we will get rain on. <laughs> I think that's pretty much the whole estate. The mainly is the mount thing here just underneath and um, it's kind of like a little bit like theater have sort of a step so type of a slope. Hopefully the weather going to be a lot better this afternoon. Struggle is real today. It's really hard. Try to like protect my camera, then try to film me, then try to play Pokemon Go. This is tough though. It's a uh, one minute rain, one minute bit sunny, then rain again, sunny again. The weather can't make up its mind. I think my camera probably need the umbrella more than I do. Sorry, camera. I'm sorry. Compared to a lot of places we have been before, it doesn't feel that big. A lot area was a block off because newly sold grass seeds. A lot of path is closing, but still be able to walk around most of the path of the garden, which is uh, pretty cool.
Hobby Show where we be earlier when it's raining so hard, right? It looks like it's a children's playroom. Maybe I need to read up the information about it. It's very nice. It's very cute. Just doing this Mali raid. The weather now is getting a little bit better now. I'm not hoping to stay like this though. On the other hand, when weather is bad, there's not a lot of people around. The place is more peaceful and enjoyable in a way. We got 18 balls. Let's see if we got shiny here. Shiny? No, that's one shiny I kind of really want though. I didn't get any during the GoFast, which is a shame. And if you are interested in my GoFast videos, the link will be down below. Made a cup of a horrible sword there, but we catch it in the end. We're going to appraise it and see how good this Maori is. Let's take a look at your Maori, shall we? Let me click it and show you how good they are. So there's the three star there. Apparently 100% will be turned into pink. We got this Maori attack and HP is so good, so I think that's 15-15. And defense is a slight weaker. Definitely going to keep this one. in the spooky world. <laughs> it's not really that spooky though. It's just a little, tiny little path. Then walking, then have a lot of like, tree, got all curved branch and stuff, which is quite cool. It's very cool. So I'm going to catch him. And what did I say? I never remember to hold, <gasps> I never remember to holding my camera on my left hand can't catch the Pokemon with my left hand while holding the camera on my right hand. So just going to catch this Smiggle. It's a massive CP114. Not a lot. But it's alright. It's okay. One, two, three. No. One more. One, two, three. Okay, right. That's cool. Okay, let's move on. This place is lovely, absolutely lovely. There's a lake in the middle. People can hire boats if they want to boating around. There's a tiny little island in the middle as well with a tiny little building in the middle of the island. So yeah, it's really, really nice day out so far. Despite we did get rain on and it's really nice work. And it's like blue vanilla. Yeah, basically it basically tastes like vanilla, but color is blue. They also have a coconut one, but it's a like black color. So I decided to try the blue vanilla. It doesn't taste anything different, just a bit blue. We've been here around four hours or so. We did take our time, walk around, do some videos, catch some Pokemon. It was all very, very good. The name set is Landscape, right? I think it's really, really well planned out. You go up the little bit hill and you go up to through the woods 
and you got the lake. They told play area for kids as well, so, so it's really really cool. Pretty much after this Mitchy ride, we're going to go. This is not too hard. I'm still on my first team. Best encounter is Geratina, I think. It's with the uh, shadow, the dark move. Ganga is good and Saint Tyranita is good. I'm not exactly an expert on this by the way so I'm not filthy casual. <laughs> Nearly there. Oh my thumb is coming off. 